How to make your app's settings menu more user-friendly. Did you know TNW Conference has a track fully dedicated to exploring new design trends this year? Check out the full sprint program here. You might not think it, but we rely heavily on our device's settings page. Maybe you're not loving the look and feel? Go to settings and change it. Do you need to run on notifications? Settings. Need help? Send feedback through settings. Love the app? Rate it through settings. Early birds get all the good stuff. Like a great price on TNW 2020 tickets. Gimme. Though accessed very less compared to other aspects of your product, its presence is what makes the product feel complete. Designing settings can be tricky since it doesn't get the needed attention it deserves and is often overlooked compared to other areas. But when done right, it will undoubtedly boost the overall experience of your app. Read, payment options in apps can be designed better. Our design team had a brief discussion on this recently, and here are some observations. Feel free to apply it if you find them useful. Your thoughts and critics are welcome as well. Also, it's mostly about mobile, but I feel the same can be applied to web settings design as well. First of all, group your categories. Settings are exhausting. There are now too many things under settings in almost all day-to-day -day apps you use. The best way to make it more accessible is to group the categories. Try to keep your number of categories to a minimum and keep them generic. When getting started, refer to your competitors or other apps before you group the categories. For example, WhatsApp for Android has a very good settings page where they group the items and also display what's inside them. The ideal groups could be general, account, notifications, appearance, privacy, help, and support, and about. Don't forget to include a search function. Though grouping as categories makes the accessibility easier, including a search will make it 5x better. Consider this scenario, the user only wants to turn on a certain notification setting. The easiest way would be to search for that particular notification item, find it in the results, and turn it on. If you don't allow a search function and have a very long list of categories, then the user needs to scan through every item inside of the CA for more on this story, visit the news article link.